Hi, this is Linda from Linda Vila Creations, and here we are with our, my, sorry, third Christmas journal. And this Christmas journal is different than anything I've ever done. It's actually a Christmas memory photo album designed by Susan Branch. If you don't know her, you can look her up. She makes amazing books, recipe books. You'll enjoy it. Uh, let's get started. Here's a beautiful charm with a very antique button, which I just love. A silver Christmas tree. Some great Christmas ribbon all tied up. I covered this with some beautiful red velvet, some white lace, and a piece here to just tie this all together. And I hope that you will see how this book helps you track your Christmases for the next four years, your memories, your traditions, your newcomers to the family. We'll get into it. Here we are on the inside cover. And one thing that I like to do is I like to enhance some of my pictures by covering it with some beautiful lace or fabric, which I've done here of this cutest little angel ever. Added some beautiful lace and it just makes it really cute. Don't you agree? As, a, as I said, this is a book where you can put your information about you and your family. And I've put some beautiful lace here with some trim and again along the side. Inside, second page, is just, I really like this. I just took this beautiful Christmas paper and just hid some cute little cutouts from this collection that I think you'll enjoy. Those cookies look good enough to eat. Here's a little snippet, and it tells you all about your guests and how you gather around the Christmas tree. Here's some new trim that I've never seen before. I think you can get this at Hobby Lobby or even Target. In here is a Christmas card, and I printed out the legend of Holly, which you will really enjoy reading. It's very cute. And you can leave it in here and give it as a gift or keep it for yourself and make some journaling notes on the back. In this page, beautiful Holly here, is a really large Christmas tag that you can journal on and it has a really cute little gingerbread guy and girl, I believe. This folds out to reveal this great little family of snowmen and plenty of journaling space to make your notes on. And here's another little story about the holly jolly Christmas, little old things that make life sweet are worth their weight in gold. They can't be bought at any price and neither are they sold. On this page, it just has some little information about things you can fix and things you can do with your kids. And again, on this page as well, beautiful little snippet here with some lace. And this little poem is about an elf, this Christmas elf that you'll enjoy reading, I'm sure. Trimmed in some gold. I stamped some Christmas trees to mimic the Christmas, <clears throat> excuse me, Christmas tree on this page. And you open up and it reveals a really cute little girl, old fashioned little girl, you can use as a Christmas tag or a bookmark. Over here I made some Christmas garland 
which I thought was really cute. And there's a poem here. It's a prayer. And it was a really beautiful prayer. And I hope you enjoy reading that as well. So this starts, at this page, this starts the first year of your Christmas memories. There's a Christmas card here I've enclosed and made. Beautiful poinsettia. A little Noel on the inside. And this is where you would tape your Christmas card or one of your Christmas cards that you're giving out for that year. Over here, you're gonna put a picture of your family and you're gonna write memories from the year of, let's say 2021. Over here, you write your traditions about your tree, the people that visited, hanging stockings, recipe for eggnog. And in here, is a bunch of little cards with some snow. And again, another little Christmas tag. And this is where you'd write your family favorites. <clears throat> Excuse me. Decorations, your ornaments, your favorite Christmas carols, your food, your drink, just little mementos. Same thing here decking the halls. How did you decorate your tree? How did you decorate the inside of your house? You could take pictures, put them here after making notes of them. And here's one of my signature things that I like to do in every book, is I put a beautiful Christmas fairy. And she is beautiful. This is where you write to Santa, you've been good, and you hope he brings you all of these things that you're going to log here so he can read them, and a shaker card, just for fun. This is where you place a photo of your children, just so you have it for that year around the Christmas tree. And in behind this bow, if I could get it undone, is a place for you to journal, to make all those little notes and secrets about your day, Christmas Day, Christmas Eve. It's just full of empty pages for you to journal on. This is some of the parties that you've attended at Christmas time, who you celebrated with and what you actually did. Up here is a little snippet of one of those deconstructed velvet poinsettia. And this is just one of the petals with some little see-through lace behind it. I love that see-through lace. And right here is where you'd put a picture of your friends having hot chocolate dinner at Christmas time. And another shaker card filled with snowflakes and snow. This is where you'd put more pictures, more information about mistletoe and good fortune and the that you've had that year. And here's a place to write what you did on Christmas Eve. Take pictures of your table, write your menu, what music you were listening to. And of course, you always have to have snacks for Santa. I love this page. Love that snowman, this ribbon, and here's a beautiful Christmas tag, or just a bookmark. Love that stocking. This is the magic of Christmas. Beautiful poem and a Christmas wish. In here, is a little treasured envelope with some more snow and just some little snippets that you can use when posting your pictures. And this is the presents under your Christmas tree that you take pictures of. And 
this is the true spirit of Christmas. It's just a little poem that I think you might enjoy reading and a beautiful snowflake on the back. Here's where you'd log all your information about Christmas Day, what everybody got, what their favorite was, and Christmas dinner. Who joined you for Christmas? Your menu, your Christmas prayer, whatever you like. And here's a beautiful picture of Santa Claus and he's waving goodbye because he's finished. He's been to your house and the day is over. This is where I'm gonna give you a little more, little more information about this book. That was the first year, 2021. And the book starts all over again. Same pages, identical. This is where you put your family picture and this is where you'd write memories from 2022. And then as you turn the pages, you will see they're all identical just like they were the previous year until you come to the end and starts all over again for the next year. To help you, I've added some beautiful charms to decipher at the end of every year or the beginning of every year. So this would be for the year of 2023. Same thing, all the information, all over again. 2024, we're really getting ahead of ourselves, aren't we? And here's a pocket that you can save all your little special letters, Christmas cards that you just can't give up, recipes, invitations, gift tags, just that mean a lot to you. And that brings us to the end of the book. O thou who has given so much, mercifully grant us one thing more, a grateful heart. That's a beautiful ending to a beautiful book. Thank you for joining me. Goodbye.